and welcome to another Thrifty Thursday. Um, boy, oh boy, look at the bag I got. <laughs> this was a spectacular Thrifty Thursday, and I can't wait to share with you what I got. Now, the bag is much bigger than what it should be, okay? So I really didn't get that much stuff, but I got some really unique things. So this is what I got. For $1, I got this, and it's plastic. Yeah, it's plastic. But I'm going to use this for something with the laundry soap or something like that. Nothing for edible. But look at this. It's huge. It's probably two gallons for a dollar. And I'm always needing the containers like this for all of the things that I make. So for $1, I got this. <laughs> for $0.10, cents, I got these little wicker little things I know but they were so cute and I love wicker and I know where I'm going with it okay but they're like little carts oh if I could find some wicker horses wouldn't that be cute so they were 10 cents each and they're going up on a shelf somewhere I know where I'm putting them and then for 25 cents I got these somebody made them they're to go over top of a canning jar but they're really cute and I sometimes get jars where they don't have lids that fit them and I'm gonna be able to use this oh my goodness I just figured out what they're for ah! oh wow okay so what they're for is they have a slit in them they're to put on top of jars and collect money in them they're little bank like the little slits in them to put pennies and quarters in oh my word I'm going to put this on my desk you know me I love taking my change in to the to the store and being able to use it for thrift store items oh wow okay I didn't even know that they have little holes in them hey we learned something together and this I thought was really unique it was a dollar and has holes in it. I thought this would be great for washing some of my herbs and stuff. I thought this was neat. It says carrots, asparagus, green beans. I don't know. It says, does anybody know what this is for? It shows vegetables. It says vegetables. I assume it's to wash things. I don't know, but I like it. So I got that. And then I got these, and they were half off for 35 cents each. Um, they're just regular trays like this. And I'm going to use these when I dehydrate my stuff. So I'm always using things like this. And of course I got a book because the red tags were half off. Holiday Home Cooking. So I got a Holiday Home Cooking cookbook. And I did look through it before I bought it. And it has some really just everyday things. So I'm really happy with that. I'm happy with anything <laughs> and this here was so cool for 75 cents and it was half off now it's brand new it's a binder but look it has stickers and you know I know I'm very childlike I like stickers I like scratch and sniff stickers and magic markers and but I thought this was adorable for 35 cents now, who could get something like this for 35 cents, brand new? So, the recipe keeper. So, I'm going to work on that. Yes, I got more of these for 50 cents. I like them. Did you know on eBay? Take a look. Look this up on eBay. You won't believe how much it costs. But, I love these freezer boxes. I'm nostalgic. I know. Then, I got a scooper for 12 cents because it was red tag that was my thrift store finds and I'm really happy with them so if anybody could tell me what this was used for I would love to know the holes are real small but I'm sure I can use it <sighs> now I'm going to share with you a little bit what I got at the post office box now this post office box was like two weeks ago so what I do is, I just once every couple weeks, I will show you what I got. The shirt I'm wearing came from 
Oh, I'd love to say her name, but I'm not sure if I can. But anyhow, she's a long time subscriber of mine. And so, I'm the chicken whisperer. <laughs> I love t-shirts like this. And to be honest with you, I had no t-shirts that actually had anything on them. Because, you know, I get the cheap t-shirts from Walmart. So, it's kind of nice to have a t-shirt with a little bit something on it. So, I'm going to share with you what I got. And it was two weeks worth. And I can't wait to see you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm going to share with you how you can find free food in your local area and tips on how you can glean some food, maybe food that was going to be thrown away in your area. So I hope you enjoy Friday's video. And I can't wait to see you guys tomorrow. Little mail call. So, <laughs> what was the theme of this mail call? Well... This was a couple weeks of things that I got, but I put it all into one video for you. So the first thing I got was, oh my word, I never have it, anything like this. The Chicken Whisperer. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I can't wait to wear it in my videos. As you know, I have plain t-shirts. It's going to be nice to have a t-shirt that actually has something really cute on it. So thank you so much. I'm not going to say the names of these girls who gave it because I didn't ask for, for permission and I'm not sure if they want me to say their names, but I really want to thank you girls for giving me this. So one of my subscribers, a long time subscriber, she gave me the shirt. And then another subscriber actually found my wish list and bought me some things on it. Uh, it's a sweatshirt which you know I like my bright colors, so I'm really thankful for that. As you know, it's getting cool here in eastern Pennsylvania, and I need to get out my winter clothing. So this is really going to be very much of a blessing for me. And then she got me something that I really wanted. I've been having a lot of problems with the corporal tunnel in my right arm and my right uh, wrist, and it, the pain goes up into my elbow. Because I do a lot of editing, I do a lot of commenting using my right hand. And so I'm hoping that this is going to make a difference and you will see me wearing it sometimes. So I'll let you know if this really helps. And also something really unique. Now this was given to me. This was in its individual box, so I'm not sure exactly who gave this. But it is marrow fat peas. That's neat. I think that is really neat. Look at these! I call them Wallies. I don't know why I call them Wallies. But I have one pair that is in really bad shape. Never had anything so pretty like this with chickens. So we have the chicken t-shirt and the chicken boots. How cute is that? I'm actually going to be in style this fall and winter. Oh I love them and they do fit me. I tried them on. And then I got this gift. So I got three gifts in all, I think. I think there were three different people in all. And then I got this. And actually, I don't have a set like this. So I'm really thankful for it. I do have little odds pieces here. But I don't have anything to get the canning lids out of hot water. And these are really neat. Colorful mason jar lids. I thought they were adorable. I don't have anything like that. And everything in my life revolves around a jar. So thank you girls for these gifts. I think it's three of you. If I'm wrong, please forgive me, but I think it was three of you that gave me this, this stuff, and I thank you so much. Can't wait to share with you in the next couple of weeks what's going to be the next haul. Take care, everyone. We'll see you guys tomorrow. I just want to take this time to thank everyone for watching my videos. You know, it's not just my channel. It's all of of us together that form a community. I'm expanding my channel to all kinds of different social medias. I'm also asking you maybe this week you could go back and watch some of my videos. This whole week my videos have been very low viewed and I rely on you to watch my videos to help me. So maybe if some of you could go back and play them it would really make a difference and I really want to thank you guys so much. So here are this week's videos. Maybe you've missed some of them. And also, make sure you're subscribed to my channel. YouTube takes a lot of subscriptions off people's channels if they don't comment. So just take a moment to make sure you're still subscribed to me.